Today you're going to use the Arkansas Next Magazine to take a career quiz and this quiz is going to return which technical profession best matches your results. So you're going to click on this link to go to pages 116 and 117 in the Arkansas Next Magazine and this is what that looks like. Then you're going to find your number by taking the quiz. So I've given you um, number one, two, three, four, and five. So if you look at question number one, and I'm going to zoom in so we can read it, on a typical Saturday you can be found cruising around and taking care of your car. You may not have a car yet, but if that's a wish, then you can choose that. Scouting and testing out the latest tech gadgets at Best Buy. Tinkering with tools and gear in the garage. Volunteering with Habitat for Humanity or binge watching HDTV. I'm not real sure why those two are grouped together. Helping mom move a couch, fix the sink, run the grill, set up new TV, internet service. You seem to be able to figure anything out. So, of those five choices, which one best matches what you would do on a typical Saturday? So if you say B, scouting and testing out tech gadgets at Best Buy, then on your worksheet you're going to highlight B and also that number four. That number four is going to assign a kind of a point value. So B would be that first selection if that's what you choose. And then you read question number two and choose A, B, C, or D, or E, whichever one best matches you. Um, some of these may not be ideal because you may not be looking at a technical profession, but choose one that would possibly fit you. You do have to complete this assignment, um, so choose one that would closely fit you. So if you choose A, again, select that A and the number that follows um, and highlight it. Um, so that you can clearly see what your choices are. So once you've highlighted all of your responses to that quiz, then you're going to go back and look at the point values that you selected. And this is where page, um, page number 117, I believe is what it is. Let me zoom out. Um, this is where this next page, number 117, is going to come into play. So if most of your answers were ones, then you are best fitted for these jobs. If most of your answers were twos, then you're best fitted for these technical positions, threes, fours, fives, okay? So look at your results. Count up the number of threes you chose, count up the number of fours, and whichever one comes up with the most, that's which um, technical career is best suited for you or careers. So let's say that you have a tie between your fours and your fives or your twos and your threes. You choose one. Go with two or go with three, go with four, or go with five. You choose if there's a tie. So in this first question, you tell me what number did you get the most? If there's a tie, tell me about the tie. And then what career degree paths were recommended for you? So remember in the event of a tie, you choose and then you would list the career paths, degrees, um, careers that are recommended for that number. Then, um, Okay, so I realized that I had the um, question duplicated, so let's try that again. So once you've um, chosen which number you have the most of, tell me what number you got the most of and then give me a brief description of why you received that result. So look at ones. Let's say that you mostly return ones. Then you receive that because you enjoy solving problems and saving the day. So just give me a brief description of why you 
received mostly ones, twos, threes, whatever it may be. Then on number two, this is where I want you to make a list of the jobs that would be perfect for you. So for ones, it would be industrial maintenance, CNC service technician, substation and transmission tech, electrician, and then agri technician. And then number three, write a paragraph about at least four sentences about why you think the quiz recommended these for you and why you would or would not be interested in them. So you may totally not be interested in technical professions, but tell me why you think the quiz returned those results for you. And then tell me um, of, of the jobs, would you be interested in any of them? Maybe you see one that you think, well, I might would and tell me why if none of them apply to you or none of them would interest you then tell me why they do not interest you notice that the jobs perfect for you have a page number corresponding with them so if you would like to learn out more about those technical careers those technical jobs go to those page numbers in this magazine and look into those careers and see more about those professions and possibly a future in a technical profession if you have any questions about today's assignment email me at smithla at whitehallsd.org RG.